Rabbits are beloved pets, known for their gentle nature, playful antics, and soft fur. However, just like any other pet, they can be susceptible to various health issues. Understanding the most common diseases that affect rabbits and how to prevent them is essential for any rabbit owner. In this video, we'll explore the top five most common rabbit diseases, their symptoms, and effective prevention strategies to keep your furry friend healthy and happy. Let's start with the first disease on our list, myxomatosis. This viral disease is notorious among rabbit populations, particularly in wild rabbits, but it can also affect domesticated rabbits. Myxomatosis is caused by the myxoma virus, which is transmitted through insect bites, particularly from fleas, mosquitoes, and ticks. Symptoms can include swelling around the eyes and ears, discharge from the eyes and nose, and lethargy. Unfortunately, myxomatosis can be fatal, so prevention is crucial. The best way to protect your rabbit is through vaccination. Regularly checking for and treating any flea infestations in your home can also reduce the risk of transmission. Keeping your rabbit indoors or in a controlled environment can further minimize exposure to infected insects. Next, we have rabbit hemorrhagic disease, R. Another viral illness that poses a serious threat to rabbits, RHD is highly contagious and can spread through direct contact with infected rabbits or indirectly through contaminated surfaces, food, or water. Symptoms may include sudden death, fever, and internal bleeding. The disease progresses rapidly, often within 24 hours, leaving little time for intervention. Vaccination is the most effective prevention method against RHD. Ensure that your rabbit is vaccinated according to your veterinarian's recommendations. Additionally, practicing good hygiene by regularly cleaning your rabbit's living area and avoiding contact with wild rabbits can help protect your pet from this deadly disease. Moving on to our third disease, we have pasteurilosis, commonly known as snuffles. This bacterial infection is caused by the bacterium Pasteurella multicida and can lead to respiratory issues in rabbits. Symptoms of pasteurilosis can range from sneezing and nasal discharge to more severe conditions such as pneumonia. Stress, poor living conditions, and a weakened immune system can increase a rabbit's susceptibility to this infection. To prevent pasteurilosis, it is essential to maintain a clean and stress-free environment for your rabbit. Ensure that your rabbit has a proper diet rich in hay, fresh vegetables, and high-quality pellets to boost their immune system. Regular vet checkups can also help catch any early signs of illness before they escalate. The fourth disease we're discussing is dental disease, a common issue among rabbits due to their continuously growing teeth. If a rabbit's teeth become misaligned or overgrown, it can lead to painful conditions such as abscesses or difficulty eating. Symptoms of dental disease may include drooling, a change in eating habits, and weight loss. To prevent dental issues, it's crucial to provide your rabbit with plenty of hay, which helps wear down their teeth naturally. Regularly checking your rabbit's teeth and scheduling routine veterinary checkups can help catch any dental problems early. If you notice any signs of dental discomfort, consult your veterinarian immediately for proper care. Lastly, we have gastrointestinal stasis, often referred to as GI stasis. This condition occurs when a rabbit's digestive system slows down or stops altogether, leading to a buildup of gas and a lack of appetite. GI stasis can be caused by various factors, including a poor diet, stress, or underlying health issues. Symptoms include a decrease in fecal output, lethargy, and signs of pain. To prevent GI stasis, it's essential to provide your rabbit with a high-fiber diet, primarily consisting of hay, along with fresh vegetables. Ensure your rabbit has access to clean water at all times and minimize stressors in their environment. Regular exercise is also vital for maintaining healthy digestion. If you notice any signs of gastrointestinal distress, seek veterinary care promptly, as this condition can quickly become serious. In summary, being a responsible rabbit owner means being aware of the common diseases that can affect your pet and taking proactive steps to prevent them. Vaccination against myxomatosis and RHD is crucial while maintaining a clean living environment and providing a proper diet can help prevent pasteurilosis and dental disease. 
Finally, ensuring your rabbit has a high fiber diet and regular exercise can go a long way in preventing gastrointestinal stasis. By staying informed and vigilant, you can ensure that your rabbit lives a long, healthy, and happy life. Thank you for watching our video on the top five most common rabbit diseases and their prevention. If you found this information helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more pet care tips and advice. Remember, a healthy rabbit is a happy rabbit, and your efforts to keep them safe and well can make all the difference in their lives. If you have any questions or would like to share your experiences with rabbit care, feel free to leave a comment below. Until next time, take care of your furry friends.